Yes, Hetero Optics. Uh, Medivh received a number of buffs. He got more damage on his Q, more damage on his auto attack. He got a quicker Q cast as well. And he got a mana reduction for his Q, both for hitting and missing. So yes, he, he got buffed quite a bit. And I think he was pretty good already. Yo, Grubby, what happened to Mediv, man? <laughs> I couldn't deliver it to pick him every time, but I still have him as a portrait. Grubby, when should you take Executioner on Rainer now? Uh, I think you should take it every time. I don't think you should sacrifice thousands of damage for a one second stun anymore unless you absolutely need it to stay alive. Greetings, friend. Do you think that they should buff Rainer? It seems like not enough utility. Uh, yeah, well, he does offer attack speed to everyone. I think he's got utility, he's got damage, he's got survivability. All he doesn't have is stuns and slows. I mean, you can skill into them, but they're kind of weak. Ah. Oh, I see Scuff. Cronaldo? Okay. I don't... I mean, I don't know uh, what they're thinking here. Gecko, thanks for the resub. I don't think Rainer needs any buffs. He just doesn't fit in the meta right now, that's all. Victory for the Forsaken. Right, Rain? I mean, your Q... First of all, your Q is missable. Executioner isn't. Secondly, Executioner basically got a buff in a recent patch. It almost always procs now. I thank you. Yo, thank you, Lucky Hots. Thank you very much. Enjoy the show. What does the heart mean in front of the icons? Ah, those are the heroes that you've earmarked as favorites. You can right click and remove from favorites or you can add others. You can only have eight favorites at a time and they will be situated at the top of the list even when other heroes may be higher level. So this is the standard level order and those would have fit in if I didn't favorite them. Now, how did I choose my favorite heroes? First of all, that's your personal preference. The way I did it is I looked at my last 60 days win rate and I said I'll just order it by the best win rate to the weakest. No, the best win rate to the eighth best win rate in order so that I have a very good overview of what are good heroes for me if I want to win in Hero League. Now some have larger sample sizes, some smaller. So there's a bit of <coughs> preferential editing. For instance, I left out um, Jaina who's 2-0 and Gazla who's 2-0. Uh, because I think the sample size is too small, but I did add Chromie, who was like 3-1, you know, something like that. I don't know. Anytime you're ready. Let's save some lives. Got him. Gul'dan show tomorrow? For sure, man. And thanks for the reset, Alar Sun. Yes, Q has a small cast time, Raging Arab. I think it was like 0.16 seconds and then it became less, like 0.0 something. I don't know. There's only one way to increase the sample size. <laughs> yes, but I could also remove the perfect win rate of Jaina and Gazla. Ah, bring the mega dip.
triple rage thinking emoji. The crusade calls. Do you know what kind of hero Gul'dan is gonna be? I think he'll be an orc warlock. And I don't know for a fact, but I can't imagine him as a tank or a support, so he should be a specialist or an assassin. And I don't know which one they'll pick. Is there anything known yet of Gul'dan's abilities? Ah. Um, something life tap. Sacrifice life to deal damage. This is the rumor that's going around. But I don't think anyone knows for sure. Which rank are you? Like 109? Or something? Why the hell you pick the worst assassin? Um, yeah. I don't think he is. He trades really well on the Immortal. Don't you know that I'm like... 3-0 lifetime show match result in Heroes of the Storm and Raynor was a big part of the wins. Honey, I've scrubbed soldiers better than you off my gloves. It's Independence Day, guys. This is Stars and Stripes Jimmy. We can't get more nationalistic than that. Wait, I'm Dutch. You know what this reminds me of? The TV show Vikings. Give me more, give me more, give me more. If I had a gun, I would shoot you. If I had a life, I would feed. After the night, when I wake up, I see what tomorrow brings. Stop singer unfollow. First you have to prove you're a follower. Singing or unsub? You got it, man. <laughs> well, that just happened. Well, that just happened. Thinking emoji. <laughs> Time to man up. <laughs> nice cue, really. Oh. Stop hitting me, please. It hurts. I got Morales. When you have a Morales in your team, it's like you don't make any mistakes because she corrects them all. No mistakes. I swear, there have been players in this game who got carried by Morales, who thought that they were a freaking god. Or goddess. Rainer, best warrior, even has sef passive self-healing. <laughs>
Ew, bio shield. I know, right? But he's a Marauders main and he always goes it. And you know what? It's not that bad if you use it well. I am principally against it normally, but come on, man. He's been using it and it's pretty good. It's a little bit of bonus. It's basically his level 20, but for someone else. As long as you don't need to spread damage too much. My potato positioning doesn't matter. Because I have Morales. Anyway, I'm wasting his mana, but... I don't know why I'm stutter stepping like such a pigeon. Let's get serious. How do I keep getting vision of him? I don't get it. This medic's my new best friend. Well, that's all thanks to Savannah and um, Morales. Main thing I learned is Rainer is how to kill full minion wave. That's, that's my best skill with Rainer. Basically, th there is a trick. They come in a straight line, stand in front of it, and press Q. Try not to miss. It goes alright every time when it does. Dominance inserted. Shadow Dagger gives vision. Yeah, but much longer than I thought. Sounds like a plan. Got him. This medic's my new best friend. Let's befriend these mercenaries. What do you mean, BM? I was. I was thinking about going back to base for some mana, but then I realized Raynor doesn't run out of mana. Then I changed my mind again, because I am a little bit out of mana, but then I realized it's really fine. I have enough mana. And then like four more times, I lingered on the edge of doubt. Let's befriend these mercenaries. This should be good. Hammer and her traits on this map. Oh. <laughs> This medic's my new best friend. It's all good. What is better, bad manners or mad banners? You ain't feeling the thing. All right. This medic's my new best friend. One in the chamber. Nice thinking process, Grandmaster Grubby. No problem. You got it covered. Oh, they trade pretty fast. Maybe we should just stim, or maybe it's because Greyman right. wasn't there. This medic's my new best friend. Give him some pepper. Alright. Alright, alright, I'm sorry. Give him some Much obliged. Charge it. You gave them what they deserved. I didn't realize I got stimmed. Do you think uh, they're gonna make Malthio hero at some point? Would be really cool. Um, I don't know Malthio. I don't know Malthio, so yeah. They got more spit. So I don't know if it would be cool or lame. Imagine if he's like some whiny demon. Because I only played Diablo 2, not 3. What if he's like a demon who always whinges when he doesn't get his way? He's from Diablo, the Reaper of Souls. Okay. He 
He's an angel? Really? Isn't he some kind of badass? Malthiel sounds super bad. Like, mal in French means bad. It's pronounced Malayal, like what? Malo? I must retreat. He's just an edgy angel. He's an angel of death. Ooh, I see. I see. I'm gonna go Hearthstone. Is Relentless Leader a mush counter? Yes, but when you have perfect Q aim, you don't need it. Yeah, you get Relentless Leader against Sundering, Gust, Gravity Lap, Slow Totem, Wolf, Power Slide, and Mush Pit. But I don't think they have any relevant stunts. As long as I got my Stim Pack and my right click, I think the opponent is in all sorts of trouble. Wait, don't tell me he lives. All I need is my Giant Killer. And my trusty Morales by my side. He lived. You monster, Athero. You absolute monster and beast. Here's this guy who hates humans and demons and angels and wants all killed. Pretty much death. Why the Archangel of Wisdom wielded the scythe is unclear. I think they were getting ready the plot I story, Gustavik. The Angirish Council rules over heaven. Maldor was the leader. Boreal, Ethereal, Imperious, and Tyrol. Maldor went mad and became the Angel of Death. <laughs> I see. Why are we still fighting? <laughs> this should be good. Got him. All right. This medic This medic's my new, new best, best friend. friend. He still has sundering. Cronaldo. Cronaldo! Sounds like a plan. Okay, watch some Kerrigan Rainer play. Perfect cues, I told you. QQ, mother trucker. Cronaldo! Fill him full of daylight. Thanks for the pick me up. Got him. Look at you boys, executioner. Maybe Swan can make me one of those. Me one of those. Look, we're never gonna get more spread by this guy, because I'll just queue him out of it. Relentless leader wouldn't have done nothing there. Time to mana. Fourth of July. 
Rainer representing all the Marines across the world. Hitting the corners and the lolos. If you were playing against Murky, would you pick a card to play? Yeah, man. And also the level 7. Victory. The level 7, uh, what's it called? There's, there's some kind of cooldown when you kill minions at 7. Um... Yes, Snoop reference. Well done, Hizo. Snoop Dog. Uh, I can't believe he stayed alive when he got attacked. Anyway. <laughs> you've got good days, if you've got bad days. I just right-click people. That's literally all I did. I hit like uh, two out of uh, every ten cues. Fourth of July. Increase ability power by fifteen percent, but reduces healing received. <gasps> wow! Way to the wow! 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 Woo! -woo. Fifteen percent, boys. Holy from allies. So you will not get reduced healing from consumed soul. Your soul shall suffer. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the one. That's the one, boys.